return. And Mason Crosby looks set now to kick it away. Mason Crosby ready for the kickoff. It'll be a touchback. Wilson's, of course, going to be the man at quarterback today. Russell Wilson is absolutely maybe the most mobile quarterback in the NFL. Hard to get a big hit on him, and if there's pressure in the pocket, he will get outside and make a play. First down on the way. Wilson set. Everybody emptied out for this snap. From the gun. Wilson's unable to connect that time. Here's the offensive line which must protect its quarterback today. Coming up, second down. Lynch is going to secure the handoff. Breaks away. That tackle was made at the 27-yard line. Nice play call that time by the offensive coordinator coming with the counter run. And the defense being too aggressive. They're over-pursuing. So you do the little counter, go the opposite direction, and it works well. Russell Wilson has it under center. The Seahawks from the 27th. Lynch. He's taken down at the 35. Well, one of the hardest things to do, and I think, in the NFL now is third and short is run the football and pick up yards. That time, nice job by the offensive line. They showed their power, and they picked up the first down. They're able to move the chains after that last run. An extra tight end on the field for this one. He'll keep it on the play fake. Trying to work that left side. Wilson's pass will go for an incompletion this time. As we take a look at this defense, Sam Shields is ready to take on the best wide receiver on the other side. He is. Every defense needs a guy like Sam Shields where they can just say, go cover that guy all game long. That's how good he is. Failing to complete that one. So second down here. Baldwin's lined up in the slot. Wilson's going to keep it. Wilson's job is to sell that play fake, and boy, did he do it that time. It fooled the defense, and they get the completion. That long gain sets them up here on this play. Play action fake, looking to throw, and he's forced to the ground. Second down coming up. Marshawn Lynch is in the backfield. They'll run it off the toss. And he's brought down by A.J. Hawk. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. It's a two tight end formation. Third down and three. Toss play here to Lynch. Williams there to take him down. Well, everybody talks about the pass in the NFL. When it's third and short, you got to man up and be tough and strong. Nice job that time by the offensive line. They let the running back get in there and pick up the first down. This will be the eighth play of this drive. First down at the 18. And he's taken down. Well, good job that time by the defense. They catch the offense off guard, and they send more guys than the offensive line can block. When you're outnumbered, it's up to the quarterback to get rid of the football. He does it, and he takes the sack. 
end of one here in Green Bay, Wisconsin. We'll be back momentarily for the start of the second. Second down. Baldwin's in the slot. Keeps it here. Pass is intercepted. Tackles made. Good job that time by the defense. Not being fooled, being in position. When you're in position, you have a chance to make the play. That time they did, they got the interception. They come to the line, and it's first down. Three Running three formation three here. Three Offense three. in the full house three. set. They'll go ground. Good work by the defense. This will be a loss of three. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. After running it, it's second down. The defense comes out in the nickel. They send the tight end in motion. Play fake. Sticks to his hands. Tackle's made, and that'll move the chains. I used to love this as a quarterback. Throw that football short, let the receiver catch it, and then look out, look at the yard depth of the catch. Really, really good job by the wide receiver. And we've reached the two-minute warning. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. Lacey lines up in the backfield. And incomplete. Didn't get his feet down. That leads us to second down. Aaron Rodgers back off the line. Shotgun formation. Finds Cobb. And that's a gain of nine. Packers do a really good job this time on offense. The quarterback throws the ball short. They pick up a few yards, and now it makes third down much easier. Third and short following the completion. Quarles playing out of position in the backfield here. Set up screen to Lacey. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. The Seahawks are going to burn the first of their three timeouts right here. Should be what we call a gimme. The field goal try. Yes, sir. Well, Jim, that field goal puts them in the lead. It was a nice drive by the offense. And what it does, it just gives you confidence. You did some positive things on the field and it should carry over for you for the rest of the game. Just across the 20 and tackled at the 21. The Seahawks come onto the field now for this next series. Russell Wilson has it under center. Play action. Wants to go deep. Clutch catch. Well, one of the prettiest plays in the NFL, maybe in all of sports, is still the long pass down the field that is completed. What a nice throw and catch. Before there's another snap, the officials want to go back and take a look at that last one. There's no question he caught the ball, but there is a question whether or not he got both feet in bounds. Well, first off, you want to make sure it's a clean catch on the sidelines. Does he have possession of the football? And then once you declare he has possession of the football, let's look down at both feet, see if they're in bounds, and don't forget, After you must, play, must maintain possession of the football as you go to the ground. 
So the boys in the booth, they want to make doubly sure the call was correct. Under two minutes, they decided, hey, we, we need to take another look at this. But the play stands as is. Yeah, Jim, it was a good challenge upstairs by the officials. Uh, it was not clear cut. But once we have seen the play in slow motion replay, well, now it's clear cut now. Got the completion. And the tackle is made at the 35-yard line. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. Still got it after the play action. Finds his mark, and that's a gain of 10. First down coming up. Offense lines up here. Keeps it here. Clay Matthews in the face of the quarterback. The Seahawks decide to take a timeout here, leaving them with only one. That timeout might be very useful for the offense. They're now ready to go. After getting sacked, it's now second and 18. Baldwin's lined up now as a slot receiver. Wilson's got it on the play action. Gets it out for the completion. Third down on the way. Lynch is in the backfield. Play fake. Makes the reception. Good job by the offense. Another first down. The defense absolutely is getting tired. And when you get tired, you make mistakes. First and goal from the 10. Wilson's able to fake into the line and still has it. Almost intercepted. Well, Jim, I threw a lot of passes like that my career where it should have been intercepted and the guy dropped it. You just go, yes, I got a break. Now can you capitalize on that break? It's now second down. On this passing down, the defense comes out in the nickel. He's in for the touchdown. Nothing like having a quarterback who has a good arm who can who can just fire that football into some tight spots, and then it helps when your receiver has got the talent and the courage to go in there and make that tough catch. The Seahawks now lined up for the extra point. And the extra point is good. The Packers, return team, hoping to set up something before the half as they've fallen behind the scores 7-3. to three. Hyde's got a chance to return this one. And the tackle's made right around the 26-yard line. The Packers will begin their drive from the 26 now. This will probably be the last play of the first half. Takes the knee. And does it for the first half. Packers trail in this one. Welcome to the Verizon Halftime Report. I'm Larry Ridley. Let's take a look back now at the first half. The Packers are down right now. But they have to feel like they're still in it. The Seahawks deserve to be ahead, but we'll need to put together another strong half. All right, let's roll those highlights. Now first and 10, Wilson's going to complete the pass, and he'll end up at the 35-yard line before being tackled. The offense would head off after throwing the interception. Target here, and he won't be brought down until he makes it to the 43 yard line. Continuing on the drive, the quick pass and completion is made, and it ends up working for a touchdown. They're now on top by four. 
All right, Larry, thanks a lot. Second half just about to get underway here as the special teams are about to head back onto the field. He's put the ball on the tee and he's about to kick off. Hyde's got a chance for a return. And he's tackled right at the 30 yard line after that return. First down here. From the gun, Rodgers. They're going to get him here for a sack. Really good job by the defensive coordinator. Good time to call that blitz. Catches the offense by surprise, and they just outnumber them, and they get to the quarterback, and they take him down. After being sacked on first down, it's second and 16. Offense lines. Has space. They'll mark him at the 34. Defense has ruled today's game, Phil. Yeah, the defense is dominating, and I'm going to be honest, it's fun to watch. Every once in a while, I like to see the offense take a beating to this, the NFL. It's all about the offense. It's nice to see the defense dominate. The Packers have it at the 34, and he's going to be dropped for the sack. That's going to bring up fourth down after just a three-play series. When you blitz on third down, you hope to get to the quarterback. Here's why. Because there are less defensive backs back there, the chances of giving up the big play are pretty high, but the rush, they're quick enough. They get there, and they sack the QB. The Packers are going to punt the football. Baldwin's got it at the 17. Still not taken down. Baldwin tackled down. The Seahawks offense now marches onto the field. Wilson comes out of the pistol. First and ten. He's scrambling now. That's an interception. That was an awesome job by the defense. They just read the quarterback's eyes. They got in position, and they made the interception. It's first down as they head to the line. Coming to the line. Hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. Adams is a receiver in the slot. He'll take the snap from the gun. Has Nelson. And he's brought to the ground. Well, I think we all know the situation here. It's a close game in the second half, and you're losing. But you pick up a first down. Oh, my gosh. That opens up many more possibilities what you can do on the offensive side. Good job by the offense. Let's see how they back up the big play here. And Rodgers will hand it off. Wagner's there to make the tackle. Jim, when you get inside the other team's red zone, inside the 20-yard line, and you're down some points, you're thinking touchdown in these situations. Lacey lines up in the backfield. This will be second down. Time is running out. The defense knows he's playing with the lead, but doing whatever it can to just try to run out the clock. 
Well, when you have good team speed on the defensive side, you can make plays just like this. You can get in the backfield and tackle the running back for a loss. After that run, third and eight for the offense. Time is beginning to fade, but the quarterback knows his team still has a chance. He must produce something in a hurry. Slashes to the left side, and he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. Number 44, They bring back out the offense to go for it. Two minutes, two minutes remaining in the game. Welcome back, and the defense trying to hold on to this lead with two minutes to go. Just about two minutes to go, and the defense knows it needs to make one last stop to end it. Looking to the right side and throwing. That picks up 11. First down. Let's see what they come up with here. Holding on to the timeout. The rush back to the line. Throws to the right. Finds Cobb. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. Throw to the left. In the book. by the quarterback for a touchdown. It was just really nice. He threw it beautifully right on target. Touchdown. The Packers with the PAT to come. Add the extra point. The kick is good. So we've got a kickoff coming up, and it's all about defense now as they've taken the lead late in the fourth. Packers now ready to kick the football down the field. Gets out past the 20 and brought down at the 24. The Seahawks coming to the line still have all three of their timeouts here in the fourth quarter. Lynch is lined up directly behind the quarterback here. He'll fire it out to the left. Russell Wilson hits Zach Miller with that throw. Every play is huge now. Second down on the way. Baldwin's going to get set in the slot for this snap. The Seahawks snap it at the 31. Wilson still got it on the play action. Russell Wilson hits Zach Miller with that throw. Big first down by the offense that time. Here in the second half, they're losing a close game, and you get that first down. It just gives you confidence. It opens up the playbook, and it just gives you a better chance of going down the field and getting the score. And now they'll be on the other side of the 50 after this play. Now on first down, every snap crucial the rest of the way. First down at the 49. Here's the handoff to Marshawn Lynch. Brought down after a gain of 15. The Seahawks signal for a timeout. They have two remaining. The Seahawks had a moment to breathe and now huddle back up while they're right now in field goal range. The Seahawks come to the line of scrimmage with two timeouts to play with. Lynch is lined up in a single back formation. Play action, Wilson. Throwing now to his left. The Seahawks, good job that time moving the chains, picking up that first down. And Jim, of course, there's no time to panic in a situation like this. I think they know that. It's in the second half. You've got, you're, you're down just a few points. Just keep looking for ways to get another first down, and that'll serve your team well. And Hayward nearly had the pick. Second down coming up. Time, obviously, a factor the rest of the way. Marshawn Lynch is in the backfield. And games 
maybe four. This is an almost must convert scenario. Third down coming up here in the late stages. Yes, that's four down territory, but you don't want to face make or break at this point. Yeah, on the defensive side, now it's time for the coach, and he's intercepted. Good piece of tackling. Got to stay aggressive on the defensive side. That time, the defense did. Even though the offense was going in to score, they finally they come up with the big play, and they get the interception inside their own 20-yard line. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. Now first and 10. Lacey takes the hit and is brought down. The Seahawks will stop the clock here with this timeout, needing to preserve time. Second down now. Adams lined up in the slot. Gets the handle here. Now slashing to the right side, looking for room. The Seahawks will call for the timeout. They need every second to be preserved at this point. Third down here. Offense trying to pick up the first. Offense lines up here. Hand off to James Starks. Line to the left. The Packers are going to punt the football. And a flag comes out. Encroachment defense. Back at the line. They're going for it on fourth. Before we go, Phil, how about a final thought about this loss? You know, Jim, when a game is over like this, when you go inside, all you think about is yourself. What did you do to give your team a better chance to win? And it hangs with you. It only changes when you go out on Wednesdays and start practicing for the next team before you get over a loss.